Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm gonna test the PC that I bought from eBay, which is imported from US. This product was priced fifteen dollars, that is thousand rupees. This is the first boot of this PC. I haven't booted this up. Unboxing link given in the description. Specification reveal in the end of the video. So let's happen. So guys, I have set up my monitor and connected it to my TV. Now the rest is to turn it on and install the OS. I think it has OS. Here you can see that is the USB flash drive which skips the setup and install my account. I just installed it from the Windows. Now let's plug it in. I don't think this will boot up because it is just a bit. Oh my goodness! It turned on. The green light just showed up. Okay. I think it will boot into the BIOS because I am pressing the Dell so that I can skip the whole of this setup. Let me zoom it up a bit. So that you can see the editings that I do. Okay, just editing some settings. That's nice. Now let's boot it up. Okay, everything is enabled. Okay, my USB flash drive skipping is also enabled. Now let's just okay cancel. Okay, guys, now it will skip the setup. I think. I think it will work. Oh my goodness, now let's check the OS. Okay, Windows, Recovery, In Beyond, Mand, and Ubuntu. Okay, it has some kind of Windows and Ubuntu. I think it's Ubuntu 14. And the Windows is, I think it's XP or maybe it's E7. Because this is, of course, a potato PC, I think. $15 potato PC. Now let's check which Windows it is. Oh my goodness! It's Windows 10, dudes! Oh, that's nice! A big thumbs up for eBay! The... Oh! The setup has been skipped and it's installed all my um, account things. Okay, I will be logging in. Now this is the home interface of it. None of my data is... It's just... None of my data is restored. Only I have inserted a whole drive, which is my personal files. It is in that pen drive. Okay, let me just refresh it. We will check. Oh. Okay, you can see it's nice. Now let's check the specifications. Go. Let's go to the properties. Let's just zoom in. Okay, it has AMD Zepron 145 2.8 GHz processor and 6 GB DDR3 RAM. It's a 64 bit operating system. You can see AMD Zepron, it says clearly install RAM is 6 GB. System time 64 bit operating system and other blah 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 things like that. Now let's check which version of Windows it is. It is Windows 10 Pro. 2015 Microsoft Corporation All Rights Reserved. Now the only thing to test is the graphics card. Which graphics card does it have? This is that GTX 1080 Ti? Maybe? Okay, it has ATI Radeon 3000 graphics, which I think it is inbuilt in the processor or the motherboard. I think it's nice graphics. Maybe I'll get a 30 FPS on 720p resolution. 
Anyway, I will leave the full info at the end of the video. The device is working properly. Okay. It's running properly. Okay, guys, let's check the internal space. Okay, 67, 67, 67, 59, 106 GB. Yes, total of 500 GB. This has a 500 GB of, of the ROM. Okay, guys, that was it. Now, let's check the full specification. And if I am not going anywhere right now, let's check the full specification of it. You can see this is the reveal the OS. It has Windows 10 Pro with Ubuntu 14. The RAM is 6 GB RAM with DDR3, which was 5000 rupees. It has 500 GB HDD ROM which worth 3000 rupees and processor AMD Cepron 145 2.8 GHz one core processor which worth rupees um, 4000. Motherboard is MSA, no M5A, 78LM6LV2 which worth 3000. Graphics is ATI AT, AT, Radeon 3000 which worth I don't know it may be 1000. The total price is. 15,000 and I have paid only 10,000 which is really really worth it max gaming FPS is 40 and 58 so that was it guys thanks for watching and see you there